Okay, so this is a little something I've been experimenting with, and I've had in my back pocket for a few months now. And this has nothing to do with that, well, kind of. It's an instant gate. But first I need to discuss, like, how this instant gate works and why you why we need it. So the basic logic bricks of Minecraft are the OR gate, where one being on turns on the stream, and the NOT gate, where it inverts it. And you can see how these are important. Essentially, the OR gate and the and and the NOT gate make up the entirety of Minecraft logic. Let's make an AND gate. This thing, as soon as one is on, the heck. As soon as, right, the AND gate, as soon as both are on, it turns on an output. But if one of them aren't on, it doesn't turn on. And the XOR gate, this only turns on <clears throat> if only one is on. It turns off if both are on or both are off. But there is an issue, and I'll demonstrate this to you. Let's turn this on and count how long it takes to turn this thing on by stepping the game one tick at a time. One, two, three, four, four. That doesn't seem like much, but it is a lot when you add it all together. Two, three, four, again. And so I set off to figure out how to solve this. And of course, the culprit is the redstone torch. The redstone torch takes two game ticks to turn on. And so I found a few designs on how to combat this. And this right here is the number one best one I could find. Let me show you. So we turn this on. Instant. And let's freeze the game. Do that. Step it and instant. Let's freeze the game again. Instant. And so I used this to create a ton of contraptions, a ton of different things. So for example, here's my AND gate, and this is instant. Here's my exclusive OR gate, and this is instant. Here is a half adder. Right now you can see it's outputting two and it is instant. Here's a full adder. Right now you can see it's outputting one because this thing is on and it <clears throat> two is instant. This is a partial adder. It's a subtractor, adder, whatever, thingamajiggy. Anyway, it actually doesn't show the entirety of this build and the entire complications inside of it. And so I made this thing. Don't ignore, ignore that for now. Ignore that. Um, this
is instant. Let's see the add. 3 plus 1 is going to be 4, and it's going to be that piston. And so let's see it. Oh yeah, small issue. It does exist. Apologies. Um, I tried to fix that. But that does highlight the issue, which I was going to say for later. But it's instant. Multiplication. Oh. Right now I have two values. Let's do... 3 times 3, which is going to return 9. And this is going to be um, not exactly instant, but it's going to have a bit of delay. I'll just update along the line quickly. Did I enter it right? Okay, that will put it six. Oh, I think I entered it, entered it wrong. Did I forget to put the one here? I for, I didn't forget to put the one here. It just didn't input for some reason. Right, because I went away before it could input. Haha. <laughs> See, that's the wonder of technology, you know? It does have a bit of delay, I will admit, but it's like the fat, it is the fastest one around. And the delay is caused by something which I will show you right now. Back to the exclusive org. Let's turn it off. So, you can see we have an instant repeater right here. This is because the input is going to be slightly, is going to have a lower signal strength, but also so that it doesn't interfere with any of this. I found that I could not do this without that. Now I can rebuild this, but I could hypothetically get some obsidian, do this. Oh wow, look at that. Except this will power the piston. Oh no biggie, just put a slab. Oh yeah, you think a slab's gonna power solve all your problems? Actually, turn this on. It does work. The only issue is that it has to be a very particular signal strength in order to get all the way. Now, I could do this, and I probably should have thought outside the box. But, that's the issue with this. Now, let me see if it still... I think, though, the issue might still persist. And I'll show you. And the issue is this. When I turn these two on, there's a bit of delay. That's the adder. This is the half adder. This is the XOR gate. My bad. It does involve an XOR gate. Here's the exclusive OR gate. And now you can probably see the amount of stuff that I've managed to squeeze in here is insane. <laughs> So 
So let's demonstrate this in action with the original. Because this just works, I guess. I'm gonna feel really dumb if I just randomly happened across the solution. See, even though it's supposed to be off, it does turn on for a second. And so, let's go down here. Quickly turn it off. Okay, let's try the solution I used there. Because I'm gonna feel real dumb if this works. Don't you love it? You know, when something works and you're just like, nah, it won't work. Why would I do that? Let's freeze the game. Because we can only see this if... I feel really dumb right now. Okay. Oh, I think I know the reason. I think I know the reason. Right. Falling edge. The reason I put those in was to counter the falling edge. Which happens every falling edge. Every single falling edge. Rising edge, it fixes the problem. Falling edge, however... It works. And then this. It's going to be a bit delayed. And so the reason I put those in here was because these were updating first. And I wanted these two to update at the exact same time. Which it seems that the instant repeater does not do. And so that is a small solution to a big problem. The only thing I can think of is put these two, put them into an OR gate. Put these two, get Falling Edge, put it into an OR gate, do some weird logic kerblamo, making sure that we don't recreate this problem, but in a different sense. And yeah, which quite frankly, I have neither the patience nor the time for, because this is already massive and took me ages. This is the adder, which I should probably fix it. Anyway, I don't care. I have the say I have it saved. And so this is just instant. It's the fastest thing around. And while there are probably solutions that exist out there, I have not been able to find them. And I just want to share this design with you. Um, I can put the schematics in the description if you so desire, so you can build it yourself. Um, that will be all, I guess. So, sayonara, losers.